Scientists have done some amazing work trying to fully understand the SARS-CoV-2 virus while fighting it in real time. But the work to understand all of COVID's long-term effects will itself be a long-term project. Now, we're years away from getting proof, but the first study has come out that supports the idea now that COVID can cause a whole host of hearing-related issues. So this study really takes a step forward with respect to answering the question, can the inner ear get infected by COVID? And the study in a nice way shows that the inner ear itself, which is a very specialized organ, can be infected by the virus. The study was published recently in the journal Communications Medicine. It found that many cells in the inner ear have a makeup that allows them to be infected by SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID. Now, again, this is far from being proof, but it does jibe with what some ear specialists like Dr. Mark Eisen are seeing in their practices. So my colleagues and I anecdotally think that we're seeing more sudden loss of hearing and balance function in one year. So that's an entity called labyrinthitis. And we think we're seeing an uptick in labyrinthitis in its frequency with COVID, but that really is not causative. But they are also seeing a preliminary connection to COVID in other areas like tinnitus, which is a ringing in the ears, as well as general hearing loss. We definitely, from an anecdotal standpoint, are seeing patients who have COVID and then get problems with those three symptoms. And any connection to tinnitus specifically needs a lot more study because believe it or not, tinnitus is not an inner ear problem. It's unfortunate that it's really hard to study because it's a brain phenomenon. This is not your ear making noise, it's your brain making noise. It's important to note that a lot of these ear problems have a variety of potential causes, and they are commonly caused by infections from other viruses as well. But regardless of what's causing the problems, remember, there are treatments. So get to a specialist like Dr. Eisen if you have problems. I'm Tim Lammers, Fox 61 News.